Hi everyone, this is the Cooler Master Hyper 212 Spectrum V3 CPU cooler and I'm going to unbox and install it in this video. So let's unbox it. Here is the fan with the 4 pin connector and the ARGB connector. All these parts we will see in a bit. The warranty info. User manual. And the cooling tower. This is my AMD stock Rath Stealth cooler and it's looking pretty clean. The thermal paste had also dried so I got this, the Cooler Master Master Gel Regular Thermal Paste. So just let me nicely unbox it. Now this is everything that was in that packet and I'm going to show you how to mount the fan but you have to do the step after installing the tower. Grab one of these clips and just attach it like this on both sides. Make sure that the connectors are on the right side with the logo on top like this. Grab this part and pull until it locks in place between the fins on both sides. And remember to do this after installing the tower on the CPU. Don't just mount it yet. Now we are going to take these plates and screws and fit them in like this. And now I'm going to apply the thermal paste. Then just place the tower carefully and make sure your motherboard back plate is aligned. Then tighten the screws diagonally. Now just mount the fan like before, in this clip I have it mounted on the wrong side, uh, so please ignore that. And connect the fan and ARGB connectors, this is where they go on this board. We are done installing and this is how it looks. And here is me controlling the RGB with the Gigabyte RGB Fusion software which is setting colors differently from what it is showing in the software. Now let's test the temperatures. This is the before temperature at idle. And here are the before temps in TCGR Wildlands reaching 92 degrees.
Now here are the after temperatures at idle and in game. So that's it i hope you like this video if you do please subscribe for more videos like this and thanks for watching bye